All right, what's up, everybody? Today is Friday, June 7th, uh, 2019. The purpose for this video is to show you guys my paycheck. And I'll probably show you guys a little bit more. And the reason for this video is because I want to prove a point uh, to you new guys. This ain't for nobody else benefit, but to you new guys. If you guys have already seen some of these OTR videos or some videos where they say that we local guys don't make money or that you can't save, I'm getting ready to prove it all right now. I'm local with a dedicated OTR route, but I'm still local. And the purpose for this video, once again, is to prove that we you can make money locally and you can save and, and all that. Uh, my all my bills is paid by the way my rent my car note I have two car notes one for my wife one for me I have a paid off Lexus that's already paid I bought that cash before I had all this before I started working uh, as a truck driver but that's just a little glimpse uh, here's the front of my yard I have a nice three story house uh, three, three, four, actually four bedrooms, but I only use three. I have an office and everything, but yeah, I had all this before I was, was a truck driver. So me being a truck driver, it didn't make me, you know, have a, have all this. I had this before. Anyway, skip all that. Uh, we're going to get into it. And I also have a couple more checks that I didn't cash. Uh, FYI, every other week I cash two paychecks. I always save one paycheck until I can cash all four of them because I get two a week every Friday I have two checks I'm trying to break it down to you guys so you can understand me I, have two, I get two checks every Friday I don't ever cash the first Friday I always wait for two full weeks to cash all four of them so I'm going to go ahead and show you guys this week paycheck and let's get started and by the way before we get started um I do have deductibles coming out, which is child support, 401k, miscellaneous, uniform, um, and what else? And health care and all that good stuff. So this is after taxes, after deductibles, my bring home. I'm going to do the small check first, my incentive pay for this week. June 7th is right up under my nose. 2019 132.52 okay I'll show you guys again I'll hold it up there a little bit longer June set there, oh no, there it go I don't know if you guys can see that if you can't comment down below and tell me if that's a clear view for you guys it don't look like it from my point of view but anyhow let's just say that you guys got it uh, there we go okay and we have this one, June 7th, 2019, $1,111 plus 51 cents. June 7th, up under my nose, 2019, $1,100 plus 51 cents. That totals out to 1244 dollars and I think five cents or something. So we're going to just say round it off to 1300 Okay. And this is from last week, which, okay, by the way, everybody knows your checks could, every week, everybody check doesn't stay the same. It fluctuates up and down. And honestly, I'm not, uh, what's the word I'm looking for? I'm not dissatisfied with, how much I get paid. I'm not embarrassed how much I get paid. This is just how much I make every Friday. And like I said, I've seen anything from 900 to fucking, or excuse my language, 900 to 1600. I've seen $2,000 checks. So it fluctuates every week, depending on how much I work or breakdowns. And as you guys, if you guys go back a couple videos ago, uh, I had a lot of breakdowns this week. I had two flat tires, and I switched my truck two or three times this week. So I had a lot of dead time. I get paid for dead times, but as you can see, not that much. Okay. This is last week, May 31st, 2019. So that's the incentive pay for last week. 
And you can tell because my check is my actual check for last week is smaller, so that means my incentive pay was is a percentage pay. So okay, so that is eighty nine thirty five. Eighty nine thirty five. May thirty first, twenty nineteen. Eighty nine thirty five. And that. May 31st, God, Lee. May 31st, 2019, $996.67. So that adds up to over a little bit over a thousand. So if you add both of those up, that's like 20 some hundred. And I just want to prove a point with this what I'm about to show you guys. This is all legal, hard earned money. That's about eighteen thousand dollars right there, and that's just what I have. Don't even worry. I ain't even gonna say what it, what I wanted to say, but for the purpose of this video, I'm just showing you guys you can save. Oop. You can save. Oh, um, and the reason why I pointed that out to you guys is because there's videos floating around saying that after your bills is paid and this and that you can't save no money you're going to be coming home with seven hundred dollars so here's the proof right here you can actually save going local i'm a local driver i'm a local driver um, I do have a credit card or a debit card and that has almost four grand on it. And I also have a bank account, which I'm not going to disclose how much is in my bank account, but I do have a, a, a nice amount put up for savings in my bank account. But, um, like I said, that's what I'm working with right now that you guys can see. I'm local, uh, for you new guys coming out here, uh, don't let this just drag you over to local either. I still say that you need to get some OTR experience before you come out here and come local or vice versa. If you're local trying to go OTR, it doesn't matter. Like where you decide to go is totally up to you. Uh, me, myself, this is my opinion. We're all truck drivers. We all do a job. We all have the same career. We just have different branches of that career. As you can see, I just I just proved to you guys that locally you can make money and all my bills are paid. All my bills is paid. Every other Friday I cash four checks every other Friday. Doesn't change. I have a lot of money put up. Let me see if you guys can see it. That's just what I got up in the safe. And then I keep my I got a bank account. And then I have a card with about four grand on there. And as you can see, I have a nice home. Uh, four bedroom. I have a Lexus in the back. Actually, you guys don't believe me. Uh, you guys don't believe me. Nah, for the purpose of this video, um, I'm just showing you guys what I'm working with. Uh, I might as well give you guys a tour. This is my lovely kitchen. But I'll just go ahead and open the door. Have a nice backyard. That's the Lexo right there. As you can see it. And in my garage, I have a I have a old school Chevy in there sitting on 24s. That's before I changed my ways. I went out and bought that stupid car. But uh, all my bills is paid. As you can see, I'm living nice. Some people don't want to live in a truck for myself, even if when I go, because I am planning on going OTR, even when I do go OTR, I'm not living in a truck. I have a beautiful home, and I like to get out, cut my grass on a weekend, on my day off, whatever time I get home. I like to uh, like to have a place for my kids to come and, and all that. So I hope you guys enjoy this video. For me doing this, you guys better like, and you better share, and comment, and tell me what you guys think. Uh... I'm challenging an uh, OTR guy. Let's expose these paychecks and let's let's see and let's put the information out here so we can get the facts about all about it all. Like it's, like I said, I'm not I'm not embarrassed about what I make. 
I uh, make decent pay, as you can see. And that's not even a, a, a little. And what I would do, I'll go back and I'll, I'll show you guys some of my bigger checks because I have no reason to lie. I'll make way more than that. I'm already at almost 46 grand for this year. It's only six months into the year. So halfway through, you do the math. That's 80 some thousand for this year. So uh, like I said, until next time, I salute all my truckers and you OTR guys. We're waiting to see you guys video. But it's all it's all love though at the end of the day. I could care less. We're just putting information out there for the public.